Sometimes operations like DynaMesh will create holes in your mesh, and these are relatively easy to fix if you use the inflate brush. You can basically fill in the geometry in the area where the problem was happening, and if you re-DynaMesh, a lot of the times it will fix what was going on there. It is difficult to sculpt and make beautiful thin geometry in ZBrush, but when you do this, you'll notice that it filled in many of those holes. Now, some of the holes it didn't fill in, you can also fix sometimes problems like this by going into your geometry modify topology thing. There is a close holes button right here. It will sometimes fill in those holes as well. And then finally, you can also use the Z modeler brush in order to fill in specific holes such as this one. If you do close here, then I can just click on that hole and it'll fill it in.